yesterday we got our chickens, our baby chicks. That same day we went out, checked the mail on our porch, and we received 30 eggs that we ordered that we weren't expecting for months. So we ordered 25 quail eggs from a website called MyShire Farms. I've seen a couple other YouTubers recommend them. Now that your eggs have arrived, we suggest you unpack the eggs and place them pointy side down for 12 to 24 hours to let them settle. We've done that. Now verify the temperature and humidity of your incubator. The temperature should be set to 99.5 degrees, plus or minus 0.5 degrees. We have our incubator set up. We bought it on Amazon. Your humidity should be between 40 to 50 degrees. We highly recommend that you have one extra temp gauge and humidity gauge to ensure your incubator is reading correctly. Don't worry, this is the easy part. Place them in your incub incubator pointy side down. Incubator has an automatic turner, but it says that you're gonna need to turn them at least three times a day. Ours turns them every two hours, so. Day one is the day we put them in there, so day one is today, and then days one through 14 is the incubation period, day 15 which means it's time, <laughs> it's time. Take your eggs out of the turner, lay them down with a little space in between each one. The big part, increase your humidity to 65 to 70 degrees. Within the next three days, you should start seeing some wiggling. Once they hatch, we suggest letting them dry for 24 hours before placing them in the brooder. I know it's tempting to let, uh, but let them dry and don't open the incubator. Last step, put them in the brooder and have fun. You're a quail parent, congrats. Thank you. 
baby, it ain't easy being Jeezy. It ain't Here? <laughs> it's really close. I bet I look super good. <laughs> Sound really good. Thank you. So do I. Uh, feel really good. <laughs> What's going on here? There's a knot there and it's not going to go through it. So you're just going to sit like that, huh? Yeah. <laughs> store today where we purchased the cedar siding for the chicken coop and the cedar shake roofing for the chicken coop and we found they had some of this which was damaged cedar from a flooring project that they were going to be doing for a really nice luxury home and it got damaged on the tongue and groove and so they had it at a humongously discounted price at the cedar store and it's like literally stunning beautiful so we actually have now we're gonna use this for the backside of the quail coop it's tongue and groove and it's beautiful and we got it for like dirt cheap so hell yeah, hell yeah brother.
gonna be a damn nice coop, guys. Cooping and pooping. What, can't we stop singing? Princess and the Frog. When I'm <laughs> and I'm and I'm and I'm what you feel is what you get. All done all we have to do is like landscaping around it but it's totally secure and ready we're gonna bring the quail in now and I'm very excited I think they're gonna like it it's a very big improvement from their teeny tiny home that they've had yeah. she is a beauty Don't worry, Woody. <laughs> Tell me I don't look like the bad guy from Toy Story. <laughs> <laughs> Toy Story 3, I think. Toy Story 2? 3? 2 or 3. Yeah, <laughs> I do. <laughs> I look like the old mean grandpa. Zach made some little hides back here for them so they can have some areas they can go under. Put a couple pieces of wood here the corners because quail have this tendency when they get spooked to pop up and we don't want them to break their necks little sand baths here. This will dry out and they can take little dust baths. Little hides and areas for them to feel safe. We're gonna bring their food and water out. We're gonna have a different food and watering system eventually. Cut a branch from a tree so they can hide in there if they need to. <laughs> you guys ready to go to your new home? Let's go! <laughs> Coming in? Don't pop in my face. Hello, babies! Oh, you guys are stinkers. Okay. Everybody out. There you go. Oh, oh he bombed. Okay. Oh. <laughs> what are you guys seeing? Hi. What are you 
you guys think?